Hello, and welcome to History Pod. On the 16th of June 1958, Hungarian communist politician Imre Naj was executed. Arrested after Soviet forces brought the Hungarian Revolution of 1956 to an end, Naj was found guilty of treason in a secret trial and was executed by hanging. Naj had been sacked from his position as chairman of the Council of Ministers in April 1955 due to his independent attitude that favoured a so-called new course in socialism. Although his moderate reforms were met with hostility in the USSR, they garnered significant support within Hungary, where opposition to the hard-line government of Matthias Rakushi had grown since the death of Stalin in 1953. Naj's popular support led to him being appointed Prime Minister on October 24, 1956, the day after the revolution began. After a week of violence, Naj recognised the crowd's desire for true political change. Despite being an ardent Marxist, he began moves towards introducing a multi-party political system and, on November 1st, announced Hungary's withdrawal from the Warsaw Pact and its status as a neutral country. This proved too much for Khrushchev in the USSR, who moved his troops into Budapest and seized control of most of the city by the 8th of November. Naj took refuge in the Yugoslavian embassy, but was arrested when he was given false promises of safe passage to leave Hungary on the 22nd of November. He and other leading members of the deposed government were imprisoned in Romania until 1958 when they were returned to Hungary for trial. News of Naj's trial and execution were only made public after the sentence had been carried out. Thank you.